Hey y'all, welcome back to Chasing Dreams Homestead. You see that right there? That's a load-bearing wall. And what am I going to do with it? I'm going to take it down! <laughs> Anyhow, y'all, listen. This was a project that we started in the spring. Early, early spring. We have not been able to work on it because we got that raw land and we've been putting all of our free time over there. It's getting cold. Our wood stove is in that room. And this wall blocks that heat from passing through the house. This wall is coming down. Mama Dreams left and has gone to Carolina to visit her family and won't be back till Sunday. So that gives me three days to get this done. I'm going to get this wall down. I'm going to get that room finished. And we're going to be good for winter. So y'all stay tuned. Watch me struggle through this because I've never done this before. And we're going to have some fun. All right, so listen, y'all. I gave you a disclaimer. I've never done this before. I got a good idea on how I'm going to do it. Y'all say a little prayer with me. Let's pray real quick. I pray this house doesn't fall down on me. I'm telling you right now, y'all. So what my plan is, is I'm going to build a temporary wall back this way. Because I tore out some of that drop-down tile. I hate drop-down ceiling tiles. But I tore some of that out. Raptors run that way. So I'm going to put my wall, temporary wall. I'm going to take this dude down. And I'm gonna put my beam in. But right now, I gotta wait on Dylan. Because Dylan's gotta go get my skill saw. I bought an expensive concrete blade I'm gonna use to cut this, make it purdy. But I got a little time to kill until he gets back. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and bust into a little bit of this just so I can see what to expect in this wall. And I'm not too worried about it because as you can see, that's not load bearing right there. The load bearing is to the side of the window. So let's get that done. what I wanted to see the block in here house we realized that most of the house is cinder block we had no clue because they got all these battens and all this panel stuff just all kinds of stuff covering it so we had no clue this was a huge surprise for us So right here we're staging for our sub wall that we're going to put up, our temporary wall. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Boy, that's a good splitter. That... Oh, bah! Jeez, son! Hey, I'm putting blood, sweat, and tears into this build for you because I love you, boo. So it took us a couple tries to get this thing right, y'all. I ain't even going to lie to you. Um, <laughs> whoever hung the ceiling, the ceiling is not <laughs> flush. So we'd get one side tight, and then the next side would pop off. But we finally got it figured out. It just it was whooping our butt for a minute. All right, guys. So we got our temporary wall up to brace it. We used a two by 12, we did not skimp on that. Every post is two two by fours. And 
Now it's time to start taking down the main wall. I'll say this much, y'all. Demoing of concrete cinder blocks is a heck of a lot more physically exhausting than just knocking out some drywall. <laughs> if you want a good exercise, go find you a block wall and take it down. So, we got that much done last night. <clears throat> Today, we still got to finish the demo. And I'll show you about how far over we're going to be coming on this wall. I started to cut a line yesterday with the saw. Just got about that much more wall left to take out. Get all that cleaned up. And then we'll put our LVLs in. Somebody <clears throat> decided they were going to be the first to sleep in the room. And she did. And like every good teenager, she had a snack. But I wanted to show y'all something. So our braces for our temporary wall, we put them on larger boards to disperse the weight so that if that does in fact begin to bear load, it's not shoving all of the force and weight of that through a very narrow two by four into the floor. That's just subfloor down there. So we wanted to make sure we dispersed the weight. Good morning, Genesis. I hope you had a good night sleeping. It's time to get the day started, my child. Y'all, as I do this project, I'm going to film every step of the way. So stay tuned for the next part of removing the wall, installing an LVL beam, and finishing the front room. <laughs> 